Namaskar, I'm Vanakam, and welcome, friends, to this guided meditation. Now, please don't listen while driving or operating any type of machinery or vehicle. Only listen when you can fully focus and have this inner experience. Now, I'm doing a series of meditations around connecting with your Ishtadevata, your Lord of your heart. And that will take on different forms for lots of different people. So this meditation today is open-ended. It's going to allow you to connect with that divinity inside of you in the form of your Ishta Devata. And it's going to be really good to start with just having a sankalpa, an intention, a vow, or purpose for doing this meditation. It could just be to take in the energy of the divine, to have an inner darshan, an inner view of the divine. Or there might be some sort of special request or question that you'd like to take to the divinity inside of your heart. So when you're ready, you can sit or lie with your spine straight. So if you're lying, you can assume the Shavasana pose. So arms comfortably shoulder width apart at your sides, palms facing up. If you're sitting, whichever asana, whichever posture is your preferred for meditation. And just allowing your eyes to close. And beginning by just repeating to yourself positively your purpose for going on this journey today. And just repeating it three times. And just relax your jaw. It can even hang loose just slightly. When you relax your jaw, you send a message throughout your nervous system. Now's a moment to relax and focus inward. As you do this, bring your awareness to the back of your tongue, back where your tongue meets your throat, and just very gently intend for it to relax. So there's no forcing, it's just setting an intention and letting go. As the tongue relaxes, the tip of the tongue can rest on the roof of the mouth. As you become aware of your breathing, feeling the flow of air in through the nose and out, feeling the cool air moving in and the warm air moving out. And as you do this, just allow your breath to begin to slow. So it's like 
your exhale can become slightly longer than the previous inhale. Just intend and let go. Even allow yourself to rest in the space in between the exhale and the next inhale. And allowing that to ever so gently expand comfortably. Even with your eyes closed, you could have a sense that you can expand your consciousness to all of the space in front of you. Expand your consciousness to all of the space behind you. Also be aware of all of the space to your left and to your light, right. Move your awareness to all of the space above you, all of the space beneath you. Also become aware of the spaciousness inside of you. Underneath your skin you can imagine vast space. It's like the arms and the legs, the hollow tubes, the torso hollow. And as a consciousness, you could float throughout the spaciousness of your body. Now you can imagine a beautiful tube running from just below the base of your spine all the way up to the crown of your head. Six points of light, beautiful white light, 
starting at the root chakra just below the spine. The next light, your creative center. The third light, your will, your power, located just above the navel. That fourth light, just behind the physical heart. The fifth light in the throat. The sixth light, right between the eyebrows, your third eye. And the seventh light at the top of the tube in the crown of your head. just becoming aware of that light behind the heart, your heart chakra. And it might stay as a white light or it might transform to a spinning green wheel or a green lotus. Or some other form that lets you know you're tapping into the center of you. And as a consciousness, as a spirit, as an awareness, you can drift into that heart of you. And in that space, Finding your beloved, the Lord of your heart, see their form, clothing, precious gems, the items being carried his or her hands. Maybe the sacred vehicle. Just become aware of their beautiful form. even pay special attention to their eyes. And connecting even more deeply and really feeling the connection, the energy. Speaking with them or maybe just having that energetic exchange, bringing your intention to that divine being inside of you. Now I'll be quiet for a few moments so that you can continue to connect with the Lord of your heart, bringing your intention, your purpose, speaking with them. We're just being in presence offering worship.
Now giving thanks, respect, bowing at your Lord's feet. Tuning into the energy of their presence inside of you. So as an awareness, as a consciousness, expanding out from the heart center, becoming aware of all seven major energy points in that beautiful tube. And recalling the energy from your beloved. And bringing your awareness back into your physical body. Back into your hands and your feet, your arms and your legs very slowly. Beginning to move. You're lying down very slowly, gently rolling to your right side, and using your left arm to support you, lifting you up, and coming back to a seated position. With your eyes closed, bringing the hands to the namaskar position, the prayer position over the heart, and just taking a few moments to bow. that divine Lord inside of you. When you're ready, opening your eyes, reorienting fully and completely to the material world, the outside world. And I really hope that you enjoyed this meditation. Uh, if you liked it, please leave a comment. If there's a specific visualization, a specific day that you'd like to have a guided meditation with, please let me know in the comments and see what I can do. Uh, let me know if this is something that you guys are interested in. Thanks so much. Namaskaram, Vanakam, and I will see you in the next video.